Hello procurement professionals. In this video, we will take a look at how to begin creating an RFQ in AirFoz. To begin, press Create RFQ from the Page Actions. Next, you can choose if you want this RFQ to be added to a new or an existing project. Let's create a new project. Add the general information, including a project name, customer, project reference number, set the status of the project, and define a data group. As the creator, you will be automatically added as the responsible person for the project. If this is a supplier project and you will be the customer you can leave the customer section blank. Press save from the page actions and you will be automatically redirected into the new project. As the first task let's create a new specification. Press create specification, give the specification a name and press save. Click on the specification name or press show lines to reveal the various ways to build your specification. You can add a single part by pressing add a part. This can be an existing part from your AirFoz product database or a new part that you create by adding the data into each cell. You can scroll to the right to add more details. Press import from BOM to add a bill of materials from your AirFoz part database to the specification. If you need to you can edit the data, for example by changing a revision, and you can use the tick boxes to delete and keep certain lines. To add the selected parts to the specification press import. You can also import data from previous orders, quotes, or categories you have set in AirFoz. Press save, and you have created your specification. If you want to create a specification based on data that is not in AirFoz you can import it from Excel. You can download the AirFoz template and fill in the data to be imported in the correct format, or you can import and organize the data in AirFoz. Let's import in Excel and organize it in AirFoz. Choose the column heading from the drop-down menu that best describes the data. You can scroll to the right to review all the data and set the appropriate column heading. If you have categories set in AirFoz you can also ensure these are set correctly. Once you have organized the data you can press confirm. Next review the BOM has been generated correctly. You can still use the tick boxes to keep or delete lines. If everything is satisfactory press import. Remember to press the save button to save the specification. As this is a new product you can also press the button to add these parts to your database. This is a quick and efficient way to add new parts and BOM to your database or to update existing parts and create revisions. Supporting data and files can also be added to your specification. You can add notes to a product in your database which will be automatically linked to a specification. Similarly, if a product has been bought or sold before and has a nonconformity associated with it, an overview of the nonconformity issue can be added to the specification. Use the file manager to upload files that you want associated with your specification. Click on the files button next to the specification. Here you can see the files already added to the specification. Press uploader to add further files. For example, technical drawings. After you have created your specification, you can create a request for quotation or RFQ by pressing the Create RFQ button. In this example, we will digitalize an RFQ that a customer has sent to our company. Perhaps they have sent it via email and we want to add it to AirFoz to ensure our data is centralized in one system. Tick the box to create an RFQ on behalf of the customer. If you added a customer to your project, they will automatically be added. Next fill in the appropriate data, review the specification, and choose if you want to include all the notes and nonconformities. Scroll to the bottom of the page and press Create RFQ. You will be redirected to the RFQ page. If you would like to create a quote for the customer you can press Create Quote from the page actions on the right hand side of the page. We hope you have enjoyed this video. To find out more about the solution go to www.airfoz.com to book your free demo. We also have a whole host of blogs and other useful material to give you insight into who the AirFoz solution is built for, what the features are, and what the pricing is. We're passionate about helping you to buy better and get 100% spend control. Maybe it's time to say hi to goodbyes.